Uh, talking about money with family members can be a tough conversation to navigate, which is why many just avoid the subject. But a new study from Ameriprise Financial found that communication is key when it comes to feeling confident about the future of your family's finances. Marcy Keckler, Vice President of Financial Strategy at Ameriprise Financial, has more. I'm Marcy Keckler, the Vice President of Financial Advice Strategy at Ameriprise Financial. And today we're talking about families and money. We have some new research that helps us understand the conversations families are having about money across generations. We talked to people who are millennials and Gen Xers and baby boomer, boomers, and we learned that they are having conversations together about money, mostly about day-to-day -day finances, which is a great start. We know the more they talk about it, the more confident they feel. But we also learned families have an opportunity to go deeper on some of the big topics. Things like estate planning and inheritance are things they tend to be a little less comfortable talking about. That's important because we know four out of five parents say they do intend to leave some sort of an inheritance to their families. But only one out of five have told their families how much to expect. And that can lead to some misaligned expectations down the road. People who expect to receive an inheritance said, on average, they think it's going to be $100,000 or more. But people who have already received one, on average, say it tends to be less than that. So misaligned expectations is something families can correct by having conversations. And families who've had these conversations together tell us it went pretty well. They were afraid it might be awkward, it might be difficult. But once they did it, they found it helped them feel better. And so there are some tips that can help families have these conversations more easily. The first is to start early. Nine out of 10 adult children said the trigger for these conversations in their family was some sort of a life-changing event, like a death in the family or a need for extended medical care. That adds financial stress to a time that's already difficult for the family. So start early and that can really help. Have a complete estate plan that includes things like your will, powers of attorney, checking the beneficiaries on your accounts, and then make sure your family knows where to find your documents. They need to be able to find them in a time of need. And finally, working with a financial professional can help have the conversation more easily with your family members. That can be somebody who can facilitate an objective dialogue. If you're looking for more information, we have great information at our website, ameriprise.com slash familywealth.